Latinoamérica ha crecido de una manera exponencial. It's a region of young people, it's a region of natural resources. Latin America is a region of makers. We're opening today the ninth World Economic Forum on Latin America. The World Economic Forum is a space that engenders trust. We can get ideas from different visions, different angles. The sentiment that I got was leading to actors having a much more clear sense of what are the actions they need to undertake. Doing the same thing you did yesterday is not enough to keep your status quo today. The people I've met have helped me with investments, with ideas. And we've spread out internet in rural areas, in towns in the middle of the jungle. How do we enhance the creation of a middle class to be less dependent on foreign markets? El crecimiento explosivo de la clase media en América Latina es la mayor oportunidad de negocio de nuestra historia. 600 million Latin Americans are eager to go forward. El reto de la inclusión no tiene que ver con el tema fundamentalmente de la educación. Education is a passport out of poverty. Education is your key to a better quality of life. Hoy estamos trabajando para generar empleos de mayor calidad y eso demanda una mayor especialización evidentemente de nuestros egresados. What's interesting about Latin America from the standpoint of a global company, you have many factors that are global that are playing out specifically also here. Es un tema de igualar las oportunidades de productividad de todos los actores económicos. Gender equality in Latin America is a big issue. Muchas de esas mujeres les falta entrenamiento básico para llevar, por ejemplo, pequeñas empresas. Recruiting the right talent, training them, keeping them is critically important. The best thing the governments can do is to enable entrepreneurship to evolve and develop. When you meet young global leaders, when you meet global shapers, you realize that they've done a great job in bringing the global agenda of the World Economic Forum to new generations. It was very important for us to get together and discuss what kind of future we want and having a positive impact in our local communities. Drug policy was a very interesting session and hopefully some takeaways will go to leaders that are in the field trying to make changes. There has to be a lot of investments in infrastructure in Latin America. You have to have better quality projects that delve into the social and environmental issues. In America Latina, el 80% de la población vive en ciudades. The climate change debate is a discussion of development, of economy, of energy, in which the business sector should be, must be very involved for the future. It is this convergence that can change minds and can enrich our way of thinking about Latin America and its future. This is very important to prepare towards a great Latin America meeting that will be taking place in Mexico in 2015. The most important thing of all is the fortalecement of the institutions, the democracy, create an environment favorable for the business. If we manage that, we will have a region that will not have a frame for growth.